I've always had a rule here. If a team or program hits me up and wants to know their helmet history, they bump right to the front of the line. Tennessee football checking in. So with that, let's get into their helmet history. We'll start with the hard shell era. 1949 through 1961, the Volunteers had a white helmet with an orange stripe down the middle. In 1962, they beefed up the look by adding players' numbers in orange to the sides. In 1963, they made the numbers blue. This would be the last time numbers appear on the side of a Tennessee helmet. 1964, head coach Doug Dickey replaces numbers with the power T. This font was used through 1966, although the helmet was modified for part of the 1965 season due to tragedy striking the program. On Monday morning, October 18, 1965, Tennessee assistant coaches Bill Majors, Bob Jones, and Charlie Rash were driving to campus in Knoxville when their car was hit by a train. Majors and Jones did not survive the crash. Rash was transported to the hospital, but succumbed to his injuries four days later on Friday, October 22nd. The next day, Saturday, October 23rd, the Vols took to the field to host Houston with players wearing a thick black cross on their helmet. The cross was made thinner and longer the next week, and the team wore them on their helmets for the remainder of the 1965 season. 1967, the more modernized team makes its debut, and this helmet is the main look through 1976. Except for three games at the end of the 1973 season when the single center stripe is changed to a pair of orange stripes. 1977, the T and the single center stripe are made much thicker under the guidance of head coach Johnny Majors, who took over the program that season. The look goes through 1982. In 1983, one change is made. The volunteers start wearing a white face mask. That look stays the same for 20 years. In 2004, the center stripe is thinned out once again and kept that way through 2006. In 2007, the thick stripe is back and continues through 2014. In 2015, the T gets a slight modification and the center stripe now turns into a checker pattern in the back. In 2018, the solid stripe returns and has been the team's main look ever since. The Volunteers, they've really only had five alternates, at least once a year between 2015 and 2017, and once in 2022, Tennessee wore this gray helmet with a checkerboard pattern on the back. In 2021, for two games, this orange, black, and white look. Two new looks emerged in 2022. The black helmet to go with their dark mode uniforms, a first at Tennessee, which has been worn twice, once in 22 and once already in 23 and the orange helmet, which the Vols wore against South Carolina. 2023 has also seen this look to go with their smoky gray uniforms. It's almost identical to the previous gray helmet, but the stripe is solid from the front to the back. All right, hit the comments. Tell me, who should I do next? And continue to follow Hooked on Helmets.